Hi, Wes Scott from Kane and Scott. Today we're gonna to talk about what is a bankruptcy estate? Um, sometimes this legal jargon can be a bit much, but when you file a bankruptcy petition with the bankruptcy court, automatically a bankruptcy estate is created. Sort of this invisible um, fencing goes around all of your assets and all of your debts. And if inside that fencing um, there are debts, then they become creditors of the bankruptcy estate. And if there are assets inside that fence, then they are assets of the bankruptcy estate and they remain assets of the bankruptcy estate until um, they are either administered by the bankruptcy trustee or usually this is what happens is that they are exempted by your attorney um, make sure you get a good attorney who knows what they're doing um, they get exempted and then 30 days passes after the 341 meeting and if there's no objection by the trustee to your exemptions which usually there's not then those assets 30 days after the meeting of creditors revert back to you and you own them again. So there is this window of time, for example, that when you file until you actually own your assets again. It's kind of a strange thing, but that's the way it works. Uh, most people have all non-exempt, or excuse me, all exempt assets, um, which means that they own, they will own all of their assets uh, 30 days after the meeting of creditors when the time is right. When you are ready, reach out to Kane and Scott. You'll be so thankful you did.